It was supposed to be his last hearing before jury selection started Monday morning, but instead, accused killer Arturo Novoa gave up. And after discussing the matter with defense counsel, we've reached the following proposed plea arrangement. Novoa was charged in the death of one-time girlfriend Shannon Graves two years ago on Youngstown's west side. Her dismembered remains were found months later stuffed into a freezer at a home in Camel. He and several others were accused of getting rid of the body and then using the victim's credit cards, cell phone, and car. You understand that if you plead guilty today, you're making a complete admission to all of these charges. In the end, Novoa repeated the word guilty to more than 40 counts, including murder, abuse of a corpse, tampering with evidence, car theft, and drug trafficking. The victim's sister tells me she had actually been looking forward to a trial. I was a little blown back, um, sort of deflated, because I did. I want everyone to know what they did. DePaul says while she had suspicions about how her sister died, having them confirmed was what she calls mind-blowing. And it's this wave that comes over you that it doesn't seem that it could be real, that that really happened, but you know it did. At this point, two others are still awaiting trial in the case, and prosecutors are trying to take back the deal made more than a year ago with third suspect Katrina Layton. In the meantime, Novoa is to be sentenced June 14th. In Youngstown, Jerry Ricciuti, WKBN 27 First News.